Altamira, a neighborhood located just 15 minutes from Sky Harbor Airport, Mill Avenue, and the ASU campus, as well as Tempe Marketplace. This neighborhood is located between the crossroads of Warner Road and McClintock Drive. This area is considered the south part of Tempe with easy access to the 101. One thing people love about this neighborhood is that these homes don't have an HOA. Many of these houses were built in the early 1980s. Located in the center of the neighborhood, you will find Goodwin Park. You'll find tons of people walking their dogs and kids playing in this huge grassy area. Plus there is an entire playground. I walked across the way to find this basketball court as well with lights so you can play at night. One thing I really like about this neighborhood is these homes still have a lot of character. Built in the 1980s, some have had some renovations, but others are just taking in that older character and some of the bright colors. As I checked out some of the homes that are for sale here, again, in the inside, some of them have been updated and some of them are a bit more original, so a new buyer can put their own flair or style into the home. When exploring this area, I really see it to be a good fit for a first time home buyer. You have easy access to highways so you can get to work anywhere in the valley. Plus these homes are still affordable, but you do also have easy access to popular areas like Scottsdale. This neighborhood is about 15 minutes, like I mentioned, from the ASU campus and the Mill Avenue area. So you are close enough, but further away that you aren't in the heart of the college town in Tempe. Now let's go explore the area a little bit. You're really close to Tempe Marketplace and other large shopping centers, but just across the way on Warner, you have access to gyms and restaurants like Zips. There are highly rated schools right here in the area. Be sure to check out some of my helpful links below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any videos. I'll see you again next week.